Okay, so looks like we can go ahead and get started. Um, so let me share my screen. Okay, can you see my screen? Uh, <clears throat> All right, awesome. Um, okay, so this is Kiowa Culture Program number 175, how Kiowa's dressed yesterday and today. And it looks like it's about 28 minutes long. So uh, we'll uh, just use their, uh, their opening prayer on here for our opening prayer today. Um, all right, uh, cool. This is the Kiowa Culture Program, June the 6th, 1979. We are at the Whitsalign Church. Our subject today is the continuation of our subject we had Monday, how the Kiowa dressed yesterday and today. Those present, George Coyadotti, James Silverhorn, Guy Tampey, Stephen Zotai, Isabel Tuhatchet, Esther Topa, Margaret Dankaw, Hazel Bolton, Yale Spotted Bird, Louis Toybull, Vicki Botger, and myself, Bessie Haiti. And this morning, we'll have our prayer by Stephen Zotai. Go hard to top elder dog, a gun palm or go hard to be the gum get on it so what to get all corner again, what dog and a go, a go on a go eight again, the key that can let the go your safe elder. Gone to show me the heart to get do a go on the dog at dog and get come out of the gun the heart to get day on the key that get too long at the. Gonde ga somik akunda kego akunda dom go koya nom do kya hi kya do ma hi kya do kya akunda de to koya ai do ta do akunda ke Jesus do kem do go kya akunda ke do ki ga the samego go mon do ta do go mon ga tha do ne to yo kya akunda ya te ki da do de me go pa de ga ya chan ke do yo Five of them dog on the yacht, eight get on the yacht, top potato. Go high, you go to eat the outside. On the yacht, go to my high yacht, out. I deserve it all the cap on the bank, he hated it, dog. Good hay get the dog, he have the kill dog, or two low yanom, don't I eat out. Nelly oak, a coon, toy, or the cap coon, that kick. Hayat Ageok, a cooled or tie, tell the Kakodak. I'm going here, good talk, a cooldak, a tutor or tender, Gamorbe or the Kakodak. Hold good day, Pagak, Edo, Golagon Gayatu, more day, Chade of Hayat out of Hayat, kill a liat out of Jesus, I'm the king, the one day I get Ageton. Get agit or Kakunda, Kiki Oyonda, Kakumbu, Tok, Akunda, Kenny, Dok, Em, Dok, Tolo, Tongi, and Om, Dodik, Akunda, Kiki, I told him Tong Kim, I could go your high, get him Toki, Hikunda, they dok, Eakon, Tango, Ampeg, Eo, do Nai, Dok, Eo, Mukak, or a dog count, and on the head over to the agit on the head or he tell the Kakunda, Kiki. Kolonda ya mo kume de don go kude kya do go kahari tam kya kumda tuloi do chai go mon go tuoi de de ko de honda ya kya boyonda do kula mon ya boy dal pege do ke go do kond don to tell this I ask in the name of Jesus Amen.
Okay. Um, so that was uh, Mr. C Stephen Zotai giving the, giving the opening prayer. Um, Grandma D, would you like to make any comments on his prayer? Well, he started out <clears throat> talking about the weather and that it was raining. And he said there was a he said the term where it rains like that and stops. And then he spoke about creation and how God made everything. And then he spoke about Kiwas being here and then prayed for Kiwas in general and those who were undergoing suffering and loss of family and health and, and uh, mostly and then he talked about how I was always prayed he prayed for the young people and the life is different nowadays for the young people and in there read in, in the scripture something so and I so by that you know that he reads his Bible that's what I got and so that was it oh yes um, your internet, the sound keeps going in and out. I turned off my video in case that will help, but, um, I could hear, I caught like about half, half of what you said, grandma. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been, <clears throat> I think it's been acting up, but not in contact with the, with the office like it used to be. Yeah. I can hear you now. Um, oh, well, so, my voice is that it's the, the internet. Again. Yeah, it's the internet. Well, we'll just uh, we'll just do our best to. <laughs> hopefully, you can hear us. Um, yeah. yeah. Awesome, and I just wanted to also share that uh, we have uh, Nelson joining us as well. So Nelson's on the line. Um, okay, well, aho, um, they own they own. ah, they own, they ain't bon. Ah, they own, they ain't bon. I ain't boy on the, they ain't hard they key. Ah, I boy on the. Ah, they own, they ain't bon, Grandma D. Ah, they own, they. Oh, she owned the door. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, let's see. Okay, I guess we'll uh, play the first speaker. So uh, this is Kiowa Culture Program number 175. How Kaya was dressed yesterday and today, and the date from this recording is June 6, 1979. Um, oh, and there's uh, Miss Marion also logging in. <clears throat> I'll wait a second before I start the recording. Hi, Miss Marion. Hopefully you can hear us okay. We were just starting um, a continuation of the recording we uh, listened to last week. Um, so this is Kiowa Culture Program number 175, How Kiowa's Dressed Yesterday and Today from June 6, 1979. And we're just about to listen to the first speaker here. So I'm gonna go ahead and press play. And uh, Ms. Marion, uh, Grandma D is with us as well as Aunt Carolyn and Nelson. Okay. Oh, um, okay. Okay. <laughs> oh. Ah, cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
唱，来跟我一起唱。Как это у вас? А что? А я? А это у тебя? А я? Как у тебя? Так я? А я где-то? Кано он сонды? Я он а я где-то? А я он? А а ой вот. Da da da. No end of the key. I'm get all I get. I'm get all I get. It's so I go on get on. Okay. Mm -hmm. He spoke really briefly. Grandma D, would you like to comment on uh, what he said? Well, he spoke about. Uh -oh. I think your uh, audio's having issues, Grandma D. It's cutting in and out. Uh, off and on. <laughs> Mel, did you get kicked off? Honey, you're uh, like uh, sounds like a robot. <laughs> I can't. I can. I can't hear you. Be better. Um, we don't. Oh no. Nope. What? <laughs> well, as long as you could hear us, we we'll hear you work. fine. Okay. Awesome. Um. Oh. Looks like we lost them. Hopefully, uh, they'll be able to connect back in. They probably had to re uh, restart Zoom. Uh, Miss Marion, I know that uh, that was uh, Louis Toibo, and he spoke really briefly. Do you want to comment on anything he said? Um, <laughs> that was. Uh rather quick i was trying to listen to him but it, um he went off too quick so let me see but the one word uh he said was hi yeah i get oh, oh, oh yeah oh, yeah i get oh yeah and he was talking speaking of far uh, long ago but still in his opening i did not quite hear Exactly. Is this about the uh, clothing? Paul. Yes. Is this the, is this really, okay. And I think he's he was stating that um, the times had their ways, but that in the past he wasn't quite sure how you get to Paul or you know exactly how. They might have dressed is what I is what I am getting with that quick uh tape. 
But if you played it again, I think we might uh, get a better understanding because uh, <clears throat> Dorothy, I don't know if she has a comment. Oh, okay. And I see uh, Grandma D got back on. Uh, Aunt Carolyn, is your connection any better? Well, we can hear you, and there isn't a signal or a message over the screen that says. Okay. Awesome. Uh, we, yeah, you, we lost, you, sound, we you lost, sound good. We lost connection two times. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, well, hopefully uh, hopefully we'll uh, stay connected. Um, but we can hear you good now. So, um, okay, I'm going to uh, play the recording over of uh, Grandma D's dad speaking. So let me go back. Okay, uncle. Go get 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 Oh, I get the higher and I always got the daughter. No, I know the key. I'm get oh, I get the. So I'm get oh, I get the. That's so I go on get on. Okay, Grandma D, I'll turn it over to you for comment. Well, he said in the past, the way Kai was lived and what they did, <laughs> they don't know, but then coming on down, he said they did see how people were dressed. And he's meaning the, the his generation or the people that are with the program. And said that they saw, but he said today they're not dressed that way. In other words, today they're not, they don't dress the way that he recalls seeing the elders. Overhaul. Oh, aho. Uh -huh. All right, uh, Miss Marion, would you like to add any comments? No, that that was correct what she said because that's what uh, was mentioned before. They did not know how the people before them, the um, uh, great grand the grandparents, I'm sure, you know exactly how they dressed. But today they can see the you know the dress style. Oh. And so that was, that was D, what D said was good. All right. Did you catch that word that you were listening for? The Haya get, get, yeah. Haya get, oh, yeah. But that was, he was talking about the past. He didn't know how. They dress that that's what D covered. Oh, so what was the term? I get and get and get the He's saying it's not that he's saying not exact words, but it means it's not the way that he recalls that this people that they saw them dress, but. Today it's different. At their time, nineteen seventy, mm. whatever seventy nine. Oh, mm. uh -huh. All right, awesome. 
Uh, let's go to the second speaker, and I'm not sure if they're going to announce who the speaker is, but we might have to uh, ask you to recognize the voice too, but we'll see who this next one is. Oh, why don't get it? No, I can't. <laughs> hey, God. God saying, back at the month, God, okay. God saying, okay, toy. Ye can yak get a one side at okay in the tongue in nineteen twenty two. They will get down and get down and go at that key or he or the dog who is bag or go up by the whole big ankle. Shake a dot ain't 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 it good. I cook in here, dog, the bag good ankle to get hold to get out. Shoot on the tongue, get down and get out. Keep long work. I hold the God get over the color say and the God uh, stiff color and no pound go bow tie. The con bone on the yank or the kid that's a derby and they don't get can con bone can not sail. The bone tie get to an um the em the top by a going go uh and us unsold that name, but old Al get all them, get so long, get tava. Not hunk or get dog, can he eat God? Nay, he got go to some me, the oil, but thought them dole with I get, nay, got to go sign the go for it. Up on ink on kick, get all them, a god sign the hunk god or can go, but don't get the hunk get peak god, a good pay good. Okay. Um, did you recognize that speaker? Yes, <clears throat> it's George Coy, darling. Oh, okay. Awesome. Mm -hmm. uh, Grandma D, would you like to comment on what he said? Well, he said that he saw the the chief way back. I saw him, and the chief was Lone Wolf. And then he named his brother, but I didn't get that. But anyway, he was describing how he saw him dressed. He had a suit on, and he had a collar and a bow tie and wore a derby hat. And that's the way he dressed with his English clothes. He didn't mention how he was dressed, what this uh, Kiowa uh, dress was, what he wore when he dressed as a Kiowa. He didn't mention that, I, I don't think. Maybe Marion heard it, but he was describing how he dressed uh, with the, uh, I guess, the white man's dress. That's what he was describing. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, uh, Miss Marion. <clears throat> he, <clears throat> he just said, "Hi, oh, yeah, oh, but oh, <clears throat> when they were dressed, and like uh, D mentioned, he said they he wore a tie, hold, which was you know a white uh, shirt." And he mentioned a stiff collar. And he said, Moho on saying he wore he wore a hat and that derby hat. But again, he was describing the white man's clothing and uh, did not mention traditional dress at all. Oh. He did mention a vest too, as I remember. Okay. Did he say bow tie in English? I think so. He said bow tie in English. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's interesting. On day, on day I'm though, Melody. On day. Um, uh, dang, Grandma D, I don't, I don't know what to call you. I'm sorry. 
That's okay. Grandma's fine. Huh? That's okay. Grandma's fine. Han day. Okay. Which 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 one? How which how gay day? Which which one? Tali or or which one? How are you related to Nelson? Uh, I guess through a uh, big boat. Uh, my grandfather. I think his grandpa Torbo was related to. Uh, I know uh, what's her name, Luella, and her sister Agnes, your grandmas or great grandmas. There is oh. uh, related to that part, not Abel's family, but Agnes's family. So right oh. now, you, we'll just play it safe and say grandma. So he said Tali or Ta? Oh, it would be Ta. Huh. Ta. Because mm -hmm. oh, his Oh, oh. Uh, Ta. Oh. Hon dem, say. Hon dem. Uy de. Ha, ha, to koi kon. Ha, te. Uh, and the dog. This, this one I was talking. I, I well, think I heard him say it at first, but I couldn't make out. Yeah, you mean uh, George Cora, darling? Oh, mm. I think he gave us Iowa name. Yeah, he said I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know what it is. He says it several times throughout. These recordings, but I've never caught his name. He said, I, just I don't get it. I think it? you need to play it again. He said it quickly. He spoke yeah. quickly. I think you should uh, play it again. Repeat. Oh, you want me to rewind it? I could uh, start over. With uh, George Coy Daddy? Oh. Okay. We'll see if we can catch his name. Uh, let's see. Hey, oh, yeah, I don't. Yeah, because he only spoke for like two minutes. So it was pretty, pretty brief. Okay. Ah, uh, cool. Oh. Why don't guy? No, I can't. Oh. Did you catch that? Was that his name? Is it by don't yeah. No, but they they don't get my coat, which means that is my name. But they don't get sounds like so much dead. They don't get. Say it again. Okay, let me. Oh, babe. Babe, don't get I. Okay, let me let me play it again. Oh, why don't get no? I can't. Oh. Did it? Did he say "bye"? Don't get. What it sounded no, like. But, but no, but, but like B E Y. Sounds like he said "bay." Bay means butcher. Bay, but I don't know. Bay don't get I. Hello. Yeah, she's talking. Yeah, okay. Okay. What is it? You want me to play it one more time? Uh, what What did Marion hear? What did you hear, Melody? What sounded sound? like by dong, yeah. Yeah, that's what like, I heard. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, like the sun? Great. 
I heard bang, bang. Bay. Bye, Dogger. Don't bye. Bye. Don't bye. Bye. She's saying bye. You're saying bye. That's it. Bye. Okay. Okay. Let me play it one more time. Bye. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Bye, Dogger. No, I can't. Bye, Dogger. Bye, don't. Bye, don't. Nelson, is, Nelson, is that what you heard? Um, hon, 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 photo, hon, 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 Bye, don't care. The reason uh, why I say I heard, bye, don't care. I, because the uh, by Dongya is the other name of uh, James Two Hatchet and also his uh, father, by Dongya. Padongya, by Dongya. Now it should be Padongya, hey, so this will be by Dongya. I, by, what is by? Oh, let's see. Uh, let me play it one more time and make sure the volume's all the way up. Oh, why don't guy? No, I can't. Oh. It's the last word I is don't guy. Guy. Bye, don't guy. Yeah. I know. Oh. I wonder if uh in one of the other recordings there's a more clear uh <laughs> Where yeah. he introduces himself. Yeah, uh, I know he said he says it. Uh, maybe not every time, but he said his name before. But I didn't get it, so yeah. so I didn't yeah. worry about it. Mm -hmm. So on with the recording, I guess. Nelson will just have to wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Uh, let's see. I'm going to try to find. Uh, okay. I think this is uh, the end of his speak speech, and then it'll go into the third speaker here. Today, the cool gum market up. ตอนนั้นที่ตาทะลีดอดเซนเตตอบะบีตะปามโดลวิดเอ่อโอ้โหมันไม่ถูกต้องเลยเฮ้ยโอ้โหอ่าคุณเองก็เกตอนที่เข
Uh, did you recognize that speaker? Stephen Zotai, I think. Because he said he remembers seeing them when he was a little boy. He's one of, he's of the younger group, Stephen and Yale Spotted Bird. Mm -hmm. Oh, um, what else did he say, Grandma D? Well, he said he remembers seeing them when they were, when he was a, a, a boy and they were, he'd see them in. He, to me, he was describing them more, referring to the men. He talked about how nice they looked and they had their moccasins and their leggings, some of them, like, mm -hmm. some of them, like, some of them had their hair braided and uh and then so those uh, and if, and those who were tall looked good and of course he said mm -hmm. I, he mentioned tall and then he said uh uh tall and then those who it was to him those who have people who knew were good craftsmen. They were the ones that looked good, I guess. And then on, you know, he's going by their quality and beauty of their, I guess, the beadwork or whatever he was referring to. Yeah. Oh. I can't remember the word he used. Margo or anyway, those who were skilled craftspeople. Mm -hmm. Anyway, yeah. Oh, oh, uh, Miss Marion, would you like to add any comments? Just a word or two. <clears throat> he just says, Bean dog, hiya, eight oy, my dog. He's talking about the past. And uh, he talked to us. Um, D, I agree with what she said. And he said, I can and speaking of the people who are tall, he said they look nice. Dress nice. And that to um, whenever they prepare to go any place, they um as he said it. Ain't oil, but thought he meant they look nice. They dressed up. That's it. Ah, a ho. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, now we're gonna go to the fourth speaker here. Let's see who it is. <laughs> Eka elde kida budget to san ma ma yo paya oi pato to to hon on kide te a elde kida pa go on ya om dona u go to ye to de ma yi ho da ke ko ma mon ko ya ye tini ko ho da ye tini ko a big pa pa o se te go ko yi to ko le go ha o te to e mo pa pa de to se ko ye ko yi to go pu a chi ko a ko mo de sai ye ye to to de um pu a ho ko gul gul to um ha se na ko mo de se パスコドコンゲドコンコンゲドでパスコオンドでサイディゴヨテガナイエトポエンゴオンオンアイカネヘニエコンポイティペゴンコルトンコトロテギャバギャボンマハマイオイトロオイバトドトデ Opi 
so long my oil but thought that okay call you to thought to go hang it up and go I couldn't get it to go I go call you to the one key day my up call and I you to God and do will be all done or what I get all soon to go to go and I am I'm told that now the key that bank or better to go a tag yet gone on the gap won't add you put you on a hunter of the money that yeah tens of the more hunter of the poor yogi go and but on the angle I ain't though Johnny on court don't you be all better don't you hunt do on but more time gets a sudden but I but and I can't up I come home go hold it down. I think I get pale by go again so long to sun. Yeah, okay. Oh, cold or the gullet gullet on boy, and I come at it. And I eat, oh, go boy, oh, good daughter boy, and I eat. Get old or money go. Just saw the dots again go all song dog or solely call and bat down to the call ha ha con de yo ne ho yet the king ha get an go coin a coin bat down to the go hang the dog or arching call daughter go hang the donne on el de chi that bon got the heat day up go on go haya a dole be on they so I on one a jay ho co. Okay, uh, Grandma D, was that Isabel to hatch it? Oh, awesome. Um, would you like to comment on what she shared? Well, I forgot a lot of it, but <clears throat> I was trying to listen to what. Uh, anyway, I did hear that her say that in the past, how women dressed and well, Kyle clothes with the blankets, and she said, around Elk Creek, that's where she's from, Hobart, in Elk Creek, she said there were only three women, I guess, that she remembered the, who left, who wore uh, dress like the old, in the old days. And she said, now people mm -hmm. dress that way, don't dress that way unless they're going to, <clears throat> of dance or participate in dancing. And then she she said and and she said the blankets had, had went by different names and then she didn't really <clears throat> say what she wanted to because she could not remember the the article of clothing that she wanted. She knew what it was but she didn't know how to say it. Uh, she said, no one is dressed that way. No one wears those. So she said she couldn't remember. She forgot. So uh, I thought that was interesting. We do that. And she oh. said, simply because you do not use those terms, you do not see them. So you don't. That's the way I am <clears throat> thinking back. Kiowa, talking about words, we don't use them. So I don't remember them. So that's the way she, and then I could say she mentioned that with um, well, the men also had different blankets to wear. So maybe Marianne can, <clears throat> can remember more, but she was quoting her uncle, Johnny Onco, and I thought he had, uh, if you would play it back where Johnny Onco was talking, he had sayings that she remembered about dressing which I thought was interesting. Oh, that, wow. that was 
that's the way he felt and spoke about being uh, dressing up. I guess that's Kiowa. <clears throat> oh. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, let's see. Before we play it back, uh, Miss Marion, do you want to add anything or do you want to listen to it again? I guess we're going to listen to it again first. So. Okay, awesome. That's fine. All right, let me rewind it. And then um, we're listening for the sayings from her uncle, Johnny Uncle. All right. Eikö Eudi kiitä, että jätty sen mä. Mä jopa ja oipa tuota, että on kiitä. Tei. Eudi kiitä, että kun on ja on tuonne uuko tuota, että mä ihuudu tätä jäkkaamaa. Mä on kodja jättiini, kun huudu jättiini, kun Ape pa pa o se te ko 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 ji to ko ali ko ha o te to e mo pa pa i te to se ko ya ko ji to ko pui a chi ko a ko mo de sa ye ye to to de um pui a ho ko gul gul to um ha se na ko mo de se Pääsy kodo kunkito kun kun kunkito de pääsy ko omto de saiki kohjo de kana iru puinko um um ai kane hei ja kompoi de pekon kortunko tulo de ja ja bomo ma i oi tulo oi pato do to de Oppi on kuin oppi, ja tuota enkä maa juu pahu. Ei sulla ei ole pahtoa, kun kohtei henki tuonne kään. Ei ole kiitä, kun on tekko loppio. Sulla on maa ei ole pahtoa, että ei koji tuota, kun henki tuota. Enkä kuntia teki kohtei koji tuota. Tu on kita mayu ko naji tu kot em dulbe all done o taji all sunto kot ko an an em em tu tem ni ada kita pengka or batu tu ko atas je ko ne on jika pun taji put u on honsulat teman kita ya tensu tamo honsulat ya poyo ki ko an batong dia, aku, aku itu cari on kuat tong dia. Beli batong tong dia hando, apa motom dia sesuatu yang beli apa aku pun pahit, apa ada kau tak pahit uji tong dia itu ku. Yan puyom dot o se ko pe oi pa to hondi pa to to ko pa to yi hondi heya to se heya to an tongye ko an poi tongye a oi pa to hap se honan a ko mong ko hulde tongye o i te kan jya pel pa e ko se gen solo an to san ya o ko Kodo de un gulot gulot on pui ana koma de ana yi do ko pui on ku do de pui ana yi do et out o mane ko kesauti to se ken ko or song do ko sule ko an patong ke de ko al ha ha ko de yo ne ho yo de ki ha ke de ne ko Kuya kuan patong jiti kohain jito ko aachin ko do dali kohain jito ne on eo di chita pon ko te hiite yo ko on ko haya atulpe on te soa on mona aajain ho ko. Okay. 
Okay. Um, let's see, uh, Grimondi, did you catch any of the uh, sayings? I thought I caught one, but I don't know what it means. What is it? I heard her say, um, Be oi ba ta. Atongya. Yeah. That's what her uh, uncle said. I remember that, but he said, Be oi ba ta. And uh, means dress, I guess. Just dress. Dress up as fine as you can, I guess. Do it now. <clears throat> and then she said, this is strange. He said that when you dress up, you need to dress up all the time. When you start dressing up after you're a widow and you start dressing up, well, then everybody knows that you're dressing while you're dressing up. So you can... Uh, attract somebody he didn't say it but that's implied and so and then the other is uh when you dress up dress up because when you like to dress and you dress up you don't grow old that's what, <laughs> that's uh -huh. what so, that's yeah. awesome. <laughs> young at heart <laughs> yeah so that's what he said that i wanted to get and then he said Call, oh, yeah, call. There's no black string shawl. Call, oh, yeah, call. Those shawls are not, and then flowered shawls, but I've been told that black string shawls are the, are the prize. They, repur they, uh, they uh, thought that was the uh, best shawl was a black. And if you go back to old photographs, you'll see women with black shawls, black string shawls. I think they were, the fringes were wider on those in those days. So I've heard that, that <clears throat> you, uh, they're a prize shawl. And I've heard my aunt say she was trying to find her. This is recently, I say recently, when I was, when I was I'm 94 now, it must have been when I was about 50 or 60. My aunt said she was looking through her trunk to look for her black, her black shawl with fringes so she could give it to her brothers, her sister-in-law, her new sister-in-law, because that's what she did. You gave the, they prized the black string shawl that much. So that's what I remembered in this what she was saying this time. Oh. oh, and he said, Johnny Onko also said, you need to dress while you can because if you have uh, the means to dress and if you have the clothing, dress because if you, because you have it, wear it. Because if you don't have it, you don't have it. I heard him say, hang your dog, go hang your dog. You heard him say that. Oh. Awesome. All right. Those are some good uh good sayings. Uh Miss Marion, would you like to add any comments? Well, that was what I caught in the first time, you know, he I thought that was the good advice what he was saying. And uh, Isabel, she said long ago <clears throat> that the women uh, wore their, well, of course, yeah, they were, you know, dressed up, but men, they wore the dresses much longer. They were longer, not short dresses. <clears throat> and uh, they wore the dresses and the aprons and they wore the shawls and today you don't know, see women using shawls like they did in the past and um she was trying to think of the color of this uh uh one shawl or material i should say she said it was good and all and and then comb so it was red and black 
and she couldn't think of the name of this uh, fabric, but she said that was used. And um, and then of course what she said uh, the people they had uh, long hair, they fixed their hair, looked nice, and when they dressed up, they looked uh, dole bay and kedokia and. Um, <clears throat> And then what Johnny Redbirds, oh, there was the other word she said about uh, on good was considered a good um, fabric, I guess, for shawl or covering for, for Paul. And uh, on good is stripes, stripe it. And to me, that sounds like those um, serapis. And um, and then, of course, that what uh, uh, and Johnny said was, you know, if you have it, use it. If you don't have it, you just don't have it. <laughs> you know, hey, you don't have it. And uh, those are just the extra side to what uh, Dolores mentioned. Ah, ah, who? Awesome. Um, any questions? I see we have a uh, Courtney joining us as well. Anyone have any questions before we continue? All right. Uh, let's see. So we're going to go to the fifth speaker and We'll see who it is, but according to our notes from the last session, they it seems like they're going in the same order. Um, in the in the last session, they had Esther Topa go next after Isabel. So we'll see if that's who speaks. All right. Uh. Uh, Eric Kiengo, Ghetto San, Haya Ego, Mayu Badongo, Eric Kia, Haya. Aoi bato do, a on do tequila, paden, getosa. Haya, toy it de atonto, he goit okoi amundo, ego e gurnit okoi amundo. Ne hetogunio haba goit onge, goit onge. Sean de to haba get high. They get those one where they can't go down. He go put a good okoy em so he go it hap a dog. He go more get more solid or hunting. He can't go get gone that girl so get dog. Oh, but dog girl, he go it okoy on the he go call on a go on a. A koi on the other, he had a go hang it on. He got a koi bag or a mozo. He go get a high get on him to king of the hope. Ah, you know. Okay, was that Esther Topa? Ha, awesome. All right, Grandma D, would you like to comment? Well, when they get down to about that number, they always say, what can I say? Everybody else has said. But then she talked about, um, we were trying to talk about how women dressed. And she said, what can we say? That all of us sitting here are dressed, not like Indians, but they have uh, white men's clothing. So that's all. No one dresses like Kiowas anymore. And uh, and she said, uh, uh, now maybe we'll wear a blanket or a shawl, and that at the most that would be it. Uh, in modern day Kiowa. That's it. Oh. Uh -huh. uh, Miss Marion? 
you like to add anything? Um, not much, but <clears throat> she said uh, today when people dress up and we uh, we don't know we know a little. He's talking about traditional dress, I guess. But she knows that, well, she said, uh, very few people use the shawl today. They don't. And she said, call dog, hang your dog, which means they don't use no shawls today. She's referring to the women. And again, what Dolores said, everything is some. Um, like boards or koi. Oh. So that's about it. Just adding to what Dolores said. Uh -huh. All right. Uh, let's see. So we'll go to the sixth speaker here and according to the order they went in for the last one it, it was margaret dang called the last time so we'll see if margaret is the one who speaks next this time okay uh cool hey we get those on my ale the key hey yeah oh but thought of Hey ho, oi bato get saw me. Hey, get get o koyom do get gon go koyon de hondo tame do mo. No, hey go yo koy go a do go. Hey go tom go u an a oi go or seven mo ko de go. I go pay more they go hey get the hey gay how they hey go more oh oh dog oh I go I go go on they he go hey get the hey oh 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 but I go to to they he get the so do go they go they go. I'm oi, but you're going to go to the door. I'm 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 going to go to the door. I hope so. Oi, but I'll get though. He go coy on the hondo tain dom. He go get cool do so me no. Oh, I get ya om though. On a ya. On a ya. Oh, go. I hope more. He go go hot toddy to him. Oi, but I'll. No. Who get I get get tall, but they ain't cold me like oil, but tall, no, cause they got punch I get by. The solo no, yeah, I get. Okay. Grandma D, what did she say that was so funny? <laughs> well, let me see. I'll try to write it down. She said that we didn't um, dress like uh, they did in the past. That that our dog, our dress is saw me. Yeah, and she went on to say that uh, uh, we didn't dress that way. And said our another way, you know, they spoke of braiding your hair, and it was long, and you braided it, and said now. Nah, you curl it, oh, oh, da. But they have curl hair, they curl their hair, and even to their eyelashes, they got fake eyelashes. 
and they have fingernail polish. <laughs> it seems that they don't want to dress like Kiwis, like the old days. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, that's what it was. <laughs> to describe it. Our modern day princesses speaking along that line last year at the 4th of July. I was sitting, I didn't go to the arena. I just sat by my niece's camp where traffic was going by <clears throat> toward the stand. I guess the whatever it was sat and people going back and forth. And <clears throat> I wear glasses and I have to wear sunglasses because I'm susceptible to skin cancer. So I had my dark glasses on and sitting there and watching. And I want you to know about, I guess I would say, well, quite a few yards away, maybe five yards was the main path. And I don't know how many Indian princesses came by with fake eyelashes. I could see them for where I was sitting. So <laughs> I don't know what Margaret would say if she saw, me, saw what I saw. <laughs> That's a long ways with dark glasses on for me. To spot the eyelashes <laughs> on all the, all the princesses and whoever came by. So, <laughs> if, it's, you don't put, if you don't put them on this year, you're lacking. <laughs> <laughs> so that, so she was saying that no one dresses like they did in the old days. And everyone, she mm. told how fine everyone looked. And and when you dress with your hair and braids and dress, sit so now. Now we have curly hair. <laughs> All that other stuff. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> so maybe Mary and can remember more, but that was funny. <laughs> oh, oh, uh, Miss Marion, would you like to add? Uh, well, that's so. Uh, that's what I heard. <clears throat> but uh, Margaret didn't call. She's talking about get oil, but though she's today, she said get so me because everything is so coy. Yeah, and then she's talking about all so, uh, which is you know the <clears throat> long hair would what take care of it. And today yeah, everybody has curly hair up, 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 and nothing is cut out. Wow. And then she's talking about the dye, the uh, pole, which is uh, where they buy yeah, lashes. And she said, Get so me. And even get uh, a bail, bail, guru. Oh me, which means she they make their lips red. And uh, she said, guess oh me. And it's like uh, a hot dog. It's like they're making fun of themselves. And um, she said, Tone go. Get boom, go get die. Yeah, she said, I've seen it. Uh, the people, she met the people long ago, and they look nice, or they look beautiful. And it's just, uh, well, I could just, what I'm adding on now, I'll say, everything is okay. And I remember when we were small, <clears throat> my uh, grandfather, he did not like that curly hair. And he would say that's Kong Yong and get on day. If anybody, you know, did that. And so he wanted us to have straight hair, long straight hair. And uh, so it just it makes me think of think of that. And when uh, my Grandpa Cattle. <clears throat> well, when he was blind, he would even, you know, touch our hair, smooth it down. 
he wanted to make sure that it was just straight, you know. Yeah. Nothing uh, like curls. Oh. But, uh, yeah, these are just comments that she had. Okay, that's it. And what Dorothy, and I mean, uh, and Dee added the other comments. So, you know, I'm not going to repeat that, what she said. Oh, a uh who? Awesome. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so let's go to the next speaker. And let's see on the last the last session it was Guy Tampy who spoke next, but we'll see. We'll see who it is. Okay. Uh, cool. Uh, they <laughs> Up with the get dog who call ye, the name go take he get dot of the get habit. Ego habit doing get on mon de mo fat but up a one yam gonna go get dog. He got sick dog, more cool than go tear tom key, toko yulda. Get more cool dog, can't to be a bag or they go get out, they go haggai. I get don't get all I hope the they go tie so don't get it so my yo pago I doggo I ho who come on the get get con tomo I'm a goop a get goop the talk or you don't get orders get on Avon all you go my yo oh no get been they are on my book Dull be same corn, but they go so on the empty do. Yeah, do. Yoko e gude do. Habe no a eight say o no a tabun do. But don't get so e ga bo do. To ge go ha ye de on de koi to am pe o no to to gu. Talk over a big home come of a ton of me up a him boot at Tabun, the old lot of one of the so I know the key oil, but talk it. Saw me the on key on no so it all. I know the key a little on talk of a noit con gam or go or go high gay or con the old tie sort of the own. Oh, you de oi, but dog, you get down your de key. On ye go book, get more good eye, get so do go. And but no get bait dope tape, your coy sad. No, no, I'm go, oh boy, I take go. Hi, yea, oi, but by golly, mom did. Okay, uh, did you recognize that speaker? Esther, I mean, Hazel Botan. Oh, Hazel Botan. All right, awesome. Grandma D, would you like to comment? Well, she said that she has two, two wears, uh, two kind, two wears chiral clothes and the, and the shawl and the nature of her work because she was a minister and People present those things to her, and she said, I wear them, I guess, on a formal occasion or when she's uh, speaking. But she said, for every day where she doesn't wear, she wears a, a alcohol dress because she said, yeah, it means that they get in the way on her housework or whatever. And so she said, people get those things to her. And then, she said, uh, 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 well, she was talking about how nowadays the young Kiowa women, how they dress and 
how they use makeup, I guess, because she mentioned that now they go around selling, uh, go around, that's when she mentioned Avon. <laughs> and so, so people bought from Avon, so that's that's where we are, I guess. <laughs> so anyway, that's what she talked about. But she did uh, she did wear a Kyra dress and a shawl on formally when she spoke along the line because she was a Methodist minister. So over her. Oh, uh who? Uh, Miss Marion, would you like to comment? Well, just a little add on to what um, Delora said. She said uh, today they, the younger girls or the younger ladies wear, you know, uh, I think she's referring to makeup. And, uh, but she said that they did it carefully and put it on carefully, wore things carefully. Uh, yeah. Ain't boy but oh, which means dressing carefully or <clears throat> preparing themselves. And they look nice, get dope go. Dope yeah. And um she said that seemed to be okay. But um Otherwise, I remember seeing uh, Hazel in church, and she would wear her um, sometimes, well, many times that I've seen her, saw her. She was wearing the Kiowa cloth dresses, and she would have the shawl on. And, you know, I thought that was nice because the way she, her hair was straight and she kept it uh, braided. And to me, that was just just the way she should look. And I guess same comment that uh, Dolores made. She's talking about see people selling um, Avon and different types of uh, cosmetics. And that's it. Oh, um, I forgot she talked about, I think she fell or something and she had a black eye. And so she said, mm -hmm. she's not putting yeah. on makeup, but the, her eye, she had a black eye, but that's the way. Uh, <laughs> that's kind of the way that she's comparing herself to the, she didn't put makeup, makeup. on it. She's really a black eye. Oh, no. mm. <laughs> ouch. <laughs> All right, uh -ho. Um, okay, let's see here. All right, we're gonna go to the next speaker. Um, we'll see who this is. We're on the eighth speaker. No, I don't mind that dog.
Okay, uh, did you recognize that speaker? Guy Candy. <clears throat> Paul. Grandma, do you, would you like to comment? Well, he was just saying that we were talking about how how men dressed and how they used to dress, but today they don't dress like they did. And some of them will have no they didn't they don't wear moccasins, they wear gray pants or different color pants, no leggings and well, they all pretty mentioned. And, and, and then, uh, then there were, uh, so he mentioned uh, in the old days, everybody would dress nice and uh, they called, they had their goo fatal. It was a word, goo fatal. And that means you're, you're, uh, hmm. Prized possessions, your fine, your finery, everything that that's uh, yours, that's personal, and that that uh, you keep all that your finery. I guess your clothes, your jewelry, or whatever, food paper, and um, that's what. And then you bring it out and you put it on. So that's what food paper is. Your your treasures. Your Prize possessions, the playlist is uh, that's what it it means as opposed to oh I forgot what uh, anyway it's your finery and that's about it that's all I remember oh uh -huh. who um, Miss Marion, would you like to comment? I was at a couple of things. Do the talking about when they dressed up long ago? Yeah, a goop with their uh finery. Dressed carefully, he says, "I saw this little a goo." And I'm not going to talk too much. And he said today, um, they, 
They wear boots and hats, different kind of shoes, and uh, on boho. That's those are hats, and then they have whiskers. Same Paul. He said those look get on, and he didn't like that with the whiskers and beards, I guess. And um, when people look nice, I always do uh, they dress carefully, I guess. And um, that is one of the things that look nice. Get on, get on time. Makes you feel good when people are dressed up in the correct way. Okay, that's about it. And I have to say. Oh, aho. That's awesome. Um... Okay, let's see here. We'll go to, we're on the ninth speaker. Uh, let's see, it looks like we have probably about, uh, uh, maybe about eight minutes left in the recording. So we'll see who speaks next. Hey, go. Ebo <laughs> Ego ke per va con de comento da mara somta ork on baton ke teo de kila ki ko ha do ke un se poda ya ork do ko como ke do ek au ta ke na ku to ork on ke somi u como kum ge ke do ne o de ki ya to za no kum ge ko a ke ki ya ha ke do do ye ko e ko ko de ko Barbecue, Okay. Uh, Grandma D, did you recognize that speaker? Stephen Hall. <clears throat> or Stephen Zotai. I don't know what name he goes by. One in, the, one in the same. Oh. Would you like to uh, comment on what he said? Well, he just talked about men that he saw. <clears throat> I was trying to say, <clears throat> he's one of the younger ones. Excuse me, I love a drink. Uh, and he talked about the braids, all the, when they were dressed, they wore, all of them had long hair, the ones he's referring to, and they wore braids, they dressed in their finery, and then they uh, used something on their hair. I would put a question mark on there, maybe Marion knows, but they didn't use, it was a different, I guess a special kind of dressing on their hair. I don't think it was a manufactured, I think it was something that Indians used a long time ago. So anyway, that's what he spoke about, was their, how fine they look with all with their long hair in braids. And he said, he named them kind of, uh, I think he said, Hossein and Guy Paul, different hairstyles. 
Skype on, I know, is that small braid up on your top of your head. So anyway, Marianne probably knows more about that. But anyway, that's that's what he was. That's what I remember mostly is the way that he he was commenting on how fine men looked when they had their long. Most, he said most of the people he's talking about he remembers did wear braids. Oh, 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 a who? All right, uh, Miss Marion, would you like to add comments? <clears throat> he was saying, "Ain't all gone home." He said they put grease in their hair, and he said, "You saw me, hey boy, but oh, he said that was strange." Hey, coot, don't yeah, hey, coot. He said they put this this um, oil in their hair, and when you were like we're around them, you could smell it. And to me, he. He did not uh, like that. I don't know. That that was the impression I got. And uh, then, of course, you know, they prefer the old style of hair <clears throat> dressing. And guy, oh, is that scalp lock? And that posse is almost the same. And um, that's about the only additions I'll add to what uh, Dolores commented. Oh, aho. All right, uh, let's see here. Um, okay, we'll see who the next speaker is. I go. Just don't sound my anger. I have the key out to our bastard. I ain't going to eat your daughter. I ain't going to cut all your daughter. I go, boy, on, I go, I have the key that guy go, okay, okay, all game. I go, stay for it. I go, 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 I ain't go don't get get dog there. I go hang I go get peak day. I ain't go no. I hunt to man go be the dog. I will get don't go by it. I go over how I go get dog. I will have to fight them king. Now I the care go don't get get dog there. I go no I ain't go be the. I can go I go okay hold that say. On key get dog you go on there. I I had a key that they go there, go get I dolly. Oh, yeah. White man's culture has taken over the Kiowa culture. I go high, yeah, it's hard. I go up, I go, I love that. Sign the dog, I go get a coat, no, I'm going to get a coat, no, I. They go get a dog, no, go more, dog, go, I 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 go, Quite <laughs> Okay, hold the back door. Go on, on, go like a hat like a. I go have a big goo, big goon, more than I get. I can be all about I go away on the key. I get big goo, I get big. Only go goo, little. 
I you I I tell you don't talk about they wanna take picture of you, look why he thought I'll be a photographer. They go about do though and so long no eight day go talk again cool how the pictures at oh yeah dog bang them. Come home and I thought but they hundred get though. I cook 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 to cook they like eight eight on me, right on. They all hear the attack or go like cook. And then it's okay on the hear. They all hear they are the key that they go hang it, they go quite or you go hang it. But all about thought they go hang, go get they go I white culture, they go up a hot table, they go I have a thought, they go to peak the angle, they go the punk all by the talk, don't hang up, get those arms, get caught those arms, go hang it on. And they are pong out. Okay. Uh did did you recognize that speaker? <clears throat> Excuse me, yes. Yes, father. <laughs> Yale Spotterbird. Oh, Yale Spotterbird. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Uh, Grandma D, would you like to comment on what he shared? Well, he's just talking about we no longer, the men especially, do no, no longer dress as Kiowa men did a long time ago. He remembers. <clears throat> The last thing that old men wear, wore was a white cloth around their waist. You're an old man, that's what you wore. That was about the last thing that all the old uh, Kiowa men wore that he remembers. And then he was saying that missionaries uh, discouraged a lot of that. And that's why they, that's, uh, I guess, among other things, missionaries discouraged the way that uh, our, our culture that we knew, dressing and so forth. And then he said, nowadays, when we wear our Kiowa uh, dresses, Kiowa was mainly to pose for photographs. And, and uh, that was. Uh, no more Kiowa culture, as he he was saying. The speech and everything is gone. Oh, <clears throat> all right. Um, I hope uh, Miss Marion, would you like to add any comments? Well, he said they only get okay. Oh, I just everything is white, like white people okay, and the children speak at okay and go go go. Don't get you know hang your dog, you peek out, which means disappearing, and uh, like he. Uh, Doris said, sometimes they, when they're at the, at the dances, powwow dances, gungya, gungya, they would, some people wear their traditional dress, but most of the time, even when they take photographs, they're dressed in, dressed like white people. And uh, everything is, White cultures taking over everything, and uh, um, that was the main emphasis. What he had to say, because he's saying our entire culture is disappearing. And you know, that I would make a comment when I was um, as a kid. I remember they would say, "Well, the." The missionaries don't want anyone to be going to the Indian dances. They're bad. They don't want anybody to be uh, speaking or 
anything that had to do with India. And then there were times when I would uh, see some of these or hear some of these missionaries. They would want something that was from our Kiowa, like they would want a pair of moccasins or they would want a beat at Medellin necklace. And one time I asked my mother, I said, they're telling, they're saying they don't want the people to um, go to the dances or have, they don't want us to have anything that's part, part of us, you know, in you. And then they're turning around and they're asking for these types of um, things like moccasins and uh, the beaded necklaces. So that was kind of, <laughs> I thought that was strange. And of course, I was just a kid, so what was I supposed? I was just making comments about what I could see and hear. Oh, and yeah, that's it. Oh, I hope. Um, okay, let's see. I think, well, it looks like there might be like a minute or so left on the recording. So I'm going to go ahead and play it. And I don't know if there's a speaker or not, but uh, we'll see. Looks like we're almost to the end. <clears throat> Maybe that's it. <laughs> oh, yep. Obaha. Okay. Oh. Yeah. All right. We made it. We made it through the end of the uh, recording. That one was, let's see, how long was it? 28 minutes and 10 seconds. And uh, Courtney or uh, Aunt Carolyn, if you're interested, um, I'm, I've been taking notes. And so it's uh, in our Google Drive. And uh, it's uh, by the date. <coughs> so. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> All right. Well, that takes us to the end of our. Uh, time today. Um, let's see here. To close us up, um, Grandma D, would you be able to do our closing prayer? Uh, Bay dot sai. I'm Tom Bado. It's all doggy. Take the doggy. Oh, the dog. how dog, I'm all good dog. Stay but hot on the I don't it Obey you. I can't pay the Amen. Amen. Aho. Amen. Aho. All right. Awesome. Well, thank you, everyone. Aho de Batha. Um, we'll uh, See everyone next uh, Sunday. And for some of you, we'll see you on Wednesday at our Wednesday session. So um, uh, let's see. Any, uh, any last minute questions or comments before we close up?
All right. Hegaba oi mangta. Hegaba. Have a good evening. Ha. Oh.